Hey everyone, Ro here from the Tech Fairies, and today I am super excited to show you my mini planner for 2019. So my current mini planner right now is my traveling planner, it's my purse planner, it goes everywhere with me. Um, but what I noticed, because it is in a horizontal layout, that I actually wasn't um, planning in it. My mini became my to-do list planner, my idea planner, you know, my note planner, but it wasn't necessarily planning out my week or my day. That's what I use my catch-all planner for, which is a classic size, and that one stays home. So I was really excited to see this one at Joann's. Um, this one is a monthly layout on here, and it says on here, no drama llama. And so this is exactly what I have been looking for. So this one is really cute. Let me zoom in here so you can see. So it's really cute. I love the color scheme here. So being that it's a monthly layout, um, it's not going to have things by week for you. So here is your currently page. And you actually have some monthly habit trackers here, important dates because it is dated, highlights, birthdays, and then here's your currently spot there. You do get a monthly spread here, and then you get sort of another dashboard here that's sort of like your master to-do list for the month. On there so monthly goals check it off note to self jot it down top priorities and what you're thankful for and then you get daily to do's and they have these sections one for each day of the month on there so you have plenty for the whole month um, and I saw this and I instantly was like this is exactly what I needed and I had bought um, the six month monthly layout extension pack but it's not as cute. And I did use it in my mini, but this is definitely what I'm gonna be using for 2019. So I'm just gonna do a quick flip through of each month because they are exactly the same on there. And I am excited to use this for 2019. I'm going to finish up the next three months in my mini right now because it is currently working for me, even though it is not, um, I hardly plan in it. I mean, I do have the same dates in it that my classic does, important dates, but I can see myself using this so much more. This is adorable. Um, on there. And I love the pink and the gold on there so this is the end there and so you get your daily to do's and you get some happy notes paper on there and I think that's the only one the only month that ends like that let's see yeah you get your happy notes but this one ends with the llama so that's going to be my planner for 2019 and again, this is the monthly layout. They do sell it in classic as well, um, but I like using my horizontal planner for classic. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you would like to see more videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications. And you can also follow us at on Twitter at TechFairies2, on Facebook or on Instagram, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.